Hello everyone, I must say it's always a real privilege to commentate from this venue, Selhurst Park in South London. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Crystal Palace up against Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. This is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Jeffrey Schlup starts alongside Eberechi Eze in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea stands between the posts. Casemiro plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the center of midfield and the lead striker today is Anthony Martial. And the game begins. For Nansch. And return to Rashford. Running with the ball confidently. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, whenever you're trying to defend against Wilfried Zaha, quite simply, you've got to be on your toes. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, we know he's got great pace, whether he's running with the ball or running in behind defenders. And that's what makes him such a threat on the counter-attack. And I'm sure that's going to be the tactics today from his team. Rashford. United might be able to cash in. can play and tonight again there it is a delightful start to this match just what they were hoping for well as you can see here the initial attempt is good but his reaction is brilliant he was so alert there So back underway in this game, Manchester United with the advantage. Advantage, Manchester United. Anthony Martial. It's a fine United move in the making. Martial. And Palace have the ball again. Bruno Fernandes Christian Eriksen now Rashford now with Eriksen Martial he knew he had to make the tackle and did Hudson Edouard the ball with Jordan are you Ezzy Loop. And he read it well defensively. Encouraging move from Crystal Palace.
And the flag has gone up. Well, he has to work a lot harder to stay onside there. He didn't read the situation at all. Rashford. Anthony. Eriksson. Very quick thinking there. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Defenders need to cover. There are so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. So almost at the break here, and not quite going to plan for the home side. Work to do, Stuart. Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attack in play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass it into their... Oh, front... wait, Stuart, they might score! Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Has the strength to hang on to it. Are you? Schluck. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Loop. Opportunity to deliver the cross. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. The referee's whistle, and that means the first half is over here in South London. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but he's general... The second half underway. United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Ericsson. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Ericsson! Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. And in it goes from Martial. Well, here's the replay. And just look at his reaction to the initial shot. He's so sharp. He deserves that goal. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Wilfred Zaha. Might be able to get in behind the defence. He could pick out a teammate. This looks promising. Ayu, can he get one back? Baran carrying out his defensive duties following the cross. A smart stop here. Well, these fans can sense an opportunity here. They need to make the most of this corner. And the short option preferred. Are you? Now just the tackle that was needed. Well, there it is. United haven't had as much of the ball, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display.
And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Martial. Here's Casemiro. Oh, surely. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Well, they've decided to make a change. They take it short. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, he's lost the ball. The of the red and into the last 20 minutes. Ericsson, decent you. position this for United to find themselves in. Fernandes. Martial. A concession of a corner here. For Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number nine, Anthony Martial. Coming onto the pitch... Number 25, Jaden Sancho. Playing it short. Sancho. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Just 15 minutes remaining. Ezzy. And a very good challenge. Bruno Fernandes. A danger here as he runs at them. Could reduce the deficit. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. And they're making a change. Now, how about the short corner? Zaha. Able to get a body in the way. Could pull one back here. Which he does! And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Bruno Fernandes. Well, no stopping him. Shaw. Bruno Fernandes. Well, visionary passing. Well, the pass in behind the defence. Quick thinking from the keeper. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Ezzy. I don't see what attacking position. It's not too late for them. And let's give credit to the defending. And that brings this game to an end. A day of frustration for Crystal Palace, all things considered. Three points dropped. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. Well, Anthony Martial caught the eye, as he's well capable of doing. Sum up his contribution for us. Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most, and with a bit more luck, he could have had a second one today.